Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. I would like to introduce the newest diesel pusher in the lineup that is going to disrupt the RV industry. This is the 2021 Holiday Rambler Armada Model 44LE. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about this new product and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Again, welcome back to another video. My name is Matt from Matt's RV Reviews. It's the world's only channel giving you that true and biased review about everything when it comes to RVs. And again, today I am super excited to be showing you, to be introducing to the world the newest diesel pusher that's gonna mess it up for everybody else. And I'm super excited to show it to you. But before we begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey, Andrea. Hi, everyone. How's it going? Oh my gosh. You guys better hold on to your seats. You better hold on to your seats, folks. I'm telling you. So there's two new diesels. Yes. And everybody knows we checked out the Nautica last week. Yes. And this is its older brother, That's the right, Armada. The Armada. You guys don't even know. You don't even know, guys. You guys don't even know what's about to happen. <laughs> Let's begin. Model is 44 LE. And the actual tip to tip length of this motorhome is 44 feet long. This is the Holiday Rambler Armada. It is the top of the line. For holiday rambler absolutely love it andrea this sits on a custom freightliner chassis xcm the engine is a 450 horsepower cummins isl 9 and it has 1250 look at those windshield wipers i absolutely love them how they come up from the top it's really awesome also if you notice right here it does have the mobile eye collision mitigation and we'll talk about that a little bit more on the inside also i love the headlight design it's really funny because um, Holiday Rambler and Fleetwood are very similar, but in my opinion, Fleetwood has always had the edge. They're the same product, but Fleetwood's always looked a little bit better, but these new Holiday Ramblers yeah. look sweet. I don't know anymore, guys. You got these nice big bus style mirrors right here, chrome, and you do have your um, cameras in the side. It does have the new Titan Bridge chassis, okay? So what that means, if you see this whole slide out, Andrea, it's all level one piece. What was on the power bridge chassis on like an LXC or something like that was these dip in the cuts and people were hitting their heads on it. So none of that, no more. Look at these tires, Andrea, they're the Michelins. 275-80R, 22.5. I love that. You have your fuel fill up on either side. Look at those beautiful doors. Nice slam latch doors, look at this nice a nice electric freezer cooler thing the, these <laughs> are awesome Domestic. that is actually pretty awesome right because like it's not a full storage thing right there so it's nice how they made it work like that look at this Ooh. oh my gosh not one but two but two wow i absolutely love this that's awesome Nice, easy glide, easy roll. Nice, That's and it locks into place. I love the frameless windows, yeah, they look nice. Frameless windows look nice. Watch back up a little bit. Let's just take a minute. And just appreciate the body paint. Appreciate the body paint, as Andrea said. I mean, it's so funny. Historically, blue is a horrible color to put on a motorhome for some reason. But when you do it like this, this is a work of art. Yes, it is. This is fantastic. We do have the nice, fancy Gerard awnings. Yes. Which I'm not a fan of. Why? I think it looks nice. They look nice. I'll explain why in a little bit. Okay. Right here, we have your LG um, flat screen TV on the outside. A little bit more storage. Uh-oh. You We're got the ladder that. for the roof. Oh, oh snap. I love these doors, Matt. These are fantastic. All right, here we go. Look, guys, we got a Dirt Devil Central Vac, Surge Guard Protector. There's your battery control center. All right, solar amp charger oh, controller. And Andrea, I gotta say one thing. 
the Carroll family bing, wanted me to let Dennis know bing, that he needs to come out and buy an RV now to and so he can put a Matt's RV review sticker on his new RV. <laughs> so come on out here, Dennis. Come on down. Nice. And we got the double axle. Yeah, so check this out, tag axle, okay? What's really interesting about these tag axles, notice I call it an Audi hubcap, right? Look, any Audi, Oh, yeah. Right? So the reason why it's like this is because when you turn this way, this back wheel will turn that way and it will make it a very tight turn, especially for such a big motorhome. That's a big upgrade. Not all tag axles have that. Okay. A little bit more storage. And a little bit more. No, Here's your inverter. Oh, wow. And everything. Coming around the back. No bumper or the stinky slinky. You have a 15,000 pound hitch. And this motorhome can tow 15,000 pounds. Wow. It is awesome and badass. You got your camera up there. Also, you have a one piece fiberglass roof. Andrea, let's go up there and take a look. Okay, hold on. Oh, 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 oh be oh, careful. Oh, hold oh, on. Oh. Here we go now. Get ready. All right. Hold on, Matt. Here we go. Okay, up here on the roof, you can see there's not one, not two, but three air conditioning units. I absolutely love that. Here's the nice Gerard awning system. Even though it's a pain in the butt, it still looks nice. And the reason why they do that is so people can't see everything going on the roof. You have your solar panel right there, your King Air digital antenna, satellite dish already on top, wing guard antenna, and your Wi-Fi Ranger. Very, very nice. Yes, please hold on. Here we go now. Oh man. All right, take your time. All right, now you're about to go on the, the, the ladder that's shaky. Okay, hold on. Oh, Matt. One more, one more. All right, there you go. Ta-da! Great, and if you haven't already, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. What are the RV salesmen's gonna take his fat ass up on a roof? Show you what features the roof has to offer. Nobody. Nobody. Matt, I, I gotta tell you, I'm in love with this RV. Andrea, <laughs> you haven't even seen the inside yet. I Just know. wait. Or, or you haven't seen the price tag yet either. I know, right? <laughs> There's the batteries. There's a great rule of thumb with RVs, folks. The prettier it is, the more expensive it is. <laughs> There's your other batteries in DEF. Here's gonna be your wet bay. Oh. 50 amp power cord reel, I love that. Awesome. Wet bay and everything, Beautiful. everything. Very nice. Got the other side of the storage over here. Yep. Fantastic. All the other side. Now, Andrea. Yes. Even though this motorhome does not have any propane whatsoever, we will still put all the specs of this motorhome right here. Bing! For everybody to see them on TV. It's also down in the description below. And you must be wondering, well, if it doesn't have propane, what does it have? It has this, the Aqua Hot 400D. Wow. This heat, this is your water heater. It also heats your floors. And it's run, powered um, completely off of um, diesel. <laughs> and there's the other side. You have two fuel tanks yep. on each side. And then this here, just a little bit more. All right, I'm ready, I'm ready, go in. Yeah. <laughs> whoa, whoa, well, Andrea, the outside of this motorhome looks great, but the inside looks even better. Let's go, take a look. Hurry, hurry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, oh wow, look at the light interior. All right, everybody. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh my Cargo gosh. 7,095 pounds. That's cargo incredible. Carrying. Look at this, you guys, how beautiful. Okay, so look at the walkway here. As you can see, the slides are in. We have a little bit of space. Here's the bathroom. And there is the bedroom. I like that the bed is accessible. All right, Matt. Oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. Wow, the light fixture. 
So look at this. No, hurry, hurry. Notice how I'm holding the button down right here? It's because it has a lock right here. So it always takes a second. It doesn't go out right away because that locked for this full wall slide. That's awesome. Now, Andrea. Yes. While the slide outs are coming out, we have a huge, huge favor to ask everyone. Look, look, look. I'm sorry. Oh, no, no, okay. I, I just wanna look, I just wanna look at the motor. If off. you could, y'all, please leave down in the comments below. Let us know three things you like about this brand new product from Holiday Rambler, and let us know three things you don't like about it. Holiday Rambler has asked me to make this video and for your feedback because it's such a brand new product. Yes. So your comments mean more than ever. And Andrea. Yes. Uh, so we have a nice little video bankroll of units. So I don't know how many subscribers we're at by the time this comes out, mm -hmm. but whatever the number is, we thank we each do. and every one of you. You guys are awesome. And I gotta tell you guys, I really enjoy reading your comments, so keep them coming. I don't enjoy them. I do. One out of ten comments, somebody <laughs> called me a fat a hole. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh my gosh. This is so beautiful. Well, not only that, I mean, I wish people could feel me right now because we've only had this motorhome on for about 20 minutes. It's very cool in and here. It's very cool. Oh, yeah. That's the power of three. Cool. Beautiful. Let's get started. Let's get started. Up here in the cockpit area. Look at this. You got your screens. You got your double screens here. You got your left blinker. You got your right blinker. You can show reverse. Everything's like this. And I love that. Now listen, some people might not love this. Some people have some side seat drivers who like to look at the cameras. And, um, but this, I, I like it because I feel like I'm in the command center. There's your mobile eye collision mitigation, okay? It's gonna let you know if you're going too fast or too slow. Well, no, too fast. And it's gonna let you know if you're going out of your lane. Oh, Andre, you wanna sit in the co-captain yes, seat? Yes, I do. Oh, okay. So for me rating a chair from one to four, four being the best, perfect. This chair is perfect, comfortable. I love that it has a footrest. So wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Are you inventing the four I, C's? I am. I am. So we have the four P's and the four C's now. Is it a C? Chair. For, for chair. Comfort. Comfort. Absolutely. Okay, four so I'm, I'm giving it the four C's. But we um, don't even know two other C's, but we'll find out. Okay, so guys, there's a nice cup holder here. Let me see this. All right, so everybody knows I, I try to say when you see diesel pushers and you have that stairwell there, there is a piece of flooring when you push the button that comes over so you will not be falling down there and then look at this you have your mcd daytime shades and privacy shades Beautiful. i love that matt huh let me see what, what, what kind of what kind of horns it got on that oh well hang on hey hang, hang on one second <laughs> sorry guys I'm just kidding. Well, I'm up. Yeah. <laughs> you got a telescoping steering wheel like awesome. this right and then for the ladies <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Also, sorry, power seats. Of yes, course. power seats, and yeah, that do, they both have footrests. Yep. No, no, not the, the driver's seat. Only the seat. passenger one yes. does, and they both swivel, guys. Yep, certainly. Over here, we do have a bunk over the cab. It does hold 500 pounds, and the engine's got to be off. Needs to be off. Oh, nice! Oh, Look nice. how fast that goes down. Beautiful. Very nice. Dude. Oh, look, see that light that came on back there? Oh, yeah. look at the ambiance there. Yep, That's gorgeous. Nice. And you have the, the cubbies over here that would slide open. Uh, not really. No. no? They look like they do. I mean, maybe a cubby or two. Yeah, it's mostly for show. But you guys, yeah. I'm loving the ambiance in here. Right. Look at the lighting. Well, Andre, right. just do another 360 with this motorhome all open. Down. Oh, it's fantastic. Look at this. It's beautiful. And the colors in here. So check this out. Now we're in the living room, okay? double sofa reclining seats but also a sofa with a trifold sofa and your tv andrea it's on the televator bum, bum, bum. i think i might have been out a little off bum, bum. look at that you guys look there's like a sound bar up there too what's yes. that called the J jbl, the JBL yeah 
Fantastic. Is what will brand the TV? Off brand or name brand? It's going to be a name brand. No. You don't think? No. Oh. Oh, snap. Samsung. Samsung Told in my you. face. <laughs> Let's check it out. Now we have these rec recliner seats, okay? These are push button and it reclines Beautiful. you. You have your lights, everything. And then right here is little tables, right? Like if you want like a little iPad table in both of them. And it's really comfortable. And then here's where you can store your remote. Matthew. Yeah. This is this is gorgeous, you guys. Look at the balances in here. Not look at that. I love them. Look at the pillows. Okay, so I love the balances. They did a here, great job. Look at the pillows. It's beautiful. And Matt, we didn't open. Let's open some of the storage over here real yep. quick. Oh, my man. How do you like the knobs? I think they're cute. Wow. It's there. Oh, wow. we got some plastic for It's okay. Storage. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Let me let me move some of this out of the way so you can get a good idea. Very nice. I I gotta say I'm really loving the interior colors. Not only that, I mean, let's check out this dinette. I mean, even look at the chair on the dinette. They've done a fantastic job with their design. Yep, solid surface countertops. This is an extension. Look at this, like, look how it even, the balance. Oh, I know. It's just really smart. And we got the daytime and nighttime shades in here. Yeah. Okay, we got a, a Blu-ray, more storage. This is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. And Matt, now, you got the standing table here that comes oh, out, okay. and it yep. does come with two more chairs. Yep, absolutely. And then over here, we got some drawers. Some drawers. Very nice. Very nice. Clothes. Yep, and then over here, this flips oh, down for a little office area. Oh, that's great. It's nice. And then there's another, there's another cabinet there. Okay, thank Very you. Nice. Yep. Very nice. Yeah, and then look at this. Oh, Matt, that's your favorite. Andrea. <laughs> Is this artwork? Art deco? I don't know, Matt. <laughs> I don't know. I'll let our I'll let our uh, RV review crew comment on that. It's obviously a Picasso. <laughs> you got your fireplace right there, but even this, even even looking at this, like the mantle or whatever exactly. the heck you want to call it's it, it's way different. The colors are so smooth and they it's flow beautiful. so well. Oh my god! And I said something about the light fixture here, you guys. You know what? The feng shui in here is, is just it, off. The it charts. is. It is off the charts. Well, Andrea, before everybody gets too excited. <laughs> it's now time for the MSRP. Burr, burr, MSRP on this motorhome here is. Okay, I gotta hear it. Four hundred and seventy-four thousand nine hundred twenty-six dollars MSRP. Sale price we have it twenty-eight percent off to three thirty-nine nine ninety-nine. That is a phenomenal price. But Andrea, we can get you an even better price than that. Tell everybody how to do it. You can call, you can text, you can email, you can FaceTime. Hey, 301-906-0962. Or mattsrvreviews at gmail.com. Or check out the website mattsrvreviews.com where you can get your official Matt's RV Review sticker. Bing! Also, there is a contact me page. Um, Andrea. Yes. I, I, I do want to say two other things. When, when you call me for a better price, I'm a salesman, I'm not a magician. <laughs> right? And and one last thing, this price point when you're over, it's very, very expensive. But when you take this price point compared to other brands that you're getting, I mean this just 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 what you're getting is absolutely phenomenal. Absolutely. Andrea, let's continue the video. My pleasure. I, I, I am just just look again, guys. I just love the ambiance here. I love the cabinetry, beautiful white cabinetry. Yep. Adjustable shelf. Look at this beautiful back and side splash. Wow. Look at it. Look at it. That is awesome. <laughs> Panoramic window. I love that. Love the long window. Solid surface countertops here. Yes. Okay, so we have the push uh, in with it. Yeah, yep. the peninsula here. Pull out peninsula. <laughs> we got ooh three drawers. I mean, this is just beautiful. Let's get over to the stove here. We got the two burner induction. Yep. Gorgeous. Everything 
those are a little heavy for me. Yeah, they're heavy. All right. Now, guys, hold on to your seats. What's we that? We have a dishwasher. Oh! Look at that. Gorgeous. <laughs> and that? we got a little, a little cabinet. Little yeah. Little oh, farmhouse sink. Well, wait, show the convection oven. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. I, I just so amazed by everything. I just totally missed it. But look, beautiful convection oven, Whirlpool. Yep. And up here we have more cabinetry, adjustable shelf. And oh my goodness, the beautiful farmhouse sink. Get a burr, shot. Burr, 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 burr. That's gorgeous. Burr, 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 burr. That's a nice sink. <laughs> this might be my favorite kitchen. Andrea. Guys. <laughs> Oh! Whoa! Wow. That's a hundred and eighty-three dollar trash can. Cause we're in such an expensive Beautiful. diesel. Beautiful. <laughs> All right, guys, we got a pantry here. Oh, look at that! I love that. Very look at nice. That. That's really. That's great. Yep. All right, so here we go with the Whirlpool Residential. Yep. Ice maker, uh, filtered water. Water filter. Great. Everything. And everything. then the freezer. Very nice. Very nice. Wow. Okay. I, I, I'm <laughs> speechless. And here's your control panel, lights, cameras, action, everything, AC unit, everything. <laughs> it's time for the first toilet test. Okay, in here. Peace box. You got medicine, medicine cabinets again. for all your medicine. <laughs> Beautiful. Yep. Matt, open that window so we can have a little bit of light in here. There we go. I mean, did you guys th did you guys really think it wouldn't be a prime pooping position once you're spending four or five hundred thousand dollars? Of course it is. Of course, it's just a prime pooping position. I guys, definitely thought it was going to be. We shouldn't even do a toilet test in here. I know because we know it was just going to pass. I just want to show the. Okay, so there's not storage right there. That's okay. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful. Yep. All Into right. the bedroom. Pocket door on the bedroom there, as yep. you can see. Tilt of your bed. Okay. The bed has to come up for you to get the slide out in. There's one wardrobe. Wow. Look at this. There's this look other this. chair. Even the folding chairs look like good quality. Definitely. You know? And look at that. There's like little, uh, you got adjustable shelves here too for shoes and everything. Oh, nice. Yep. Oh, this is the remote for the bed. Okay. Okay, so you got good size drawers there too. Oh yeah. Well drawers. Awesome. And I like that there's the window there. Check out the balance there is cute. Yep. Got right the here. second wardrobe there. TV up here, even LG. Okay. All right, look, you got a nice mirror right there. Yep. Here's the bed. Again, it does have to be tilted up. Are you going to um No. You're not gonna put the bed down? No. Okay. Um, but right up there we do have that. And right over here. Nice. And you know what, Matt? What's that? The headboard's really cute. Uh-huh. I mean, you can see it, guys. But the white and the blue together. Nice. And Gorgeous. Then you do have pocket doors for the bedroom area. Also, awesome. also right under here is a camera selector, okay? So if you're watching TV and you hear something on your outside, you push that button and on awesome. your television, it will show you a camera. And there's the other mirror and you do have a little bit of a nightstand here. Oh, wow. USB. Oh my goodness, look oh at this God. bathroom. Oh my G. Holy moly, guys. Oh my G A W -E. Wow. Hey MJ, MJ, Izzy and MJ from Endless RVing. They're from New Jersey. Oh my God. <laughs> this is gorgeous. Oh wow, look at this. <whistles> oh my goodness. Raindrops are falling on my head. Hey Matt. Andrea. Wait, hold on. Look at this guys. You can literally fit two people in here in a class A diesel. Mom? <laughs> That's not funny. But look, look at, okay, so I wanna say, Matt. Yes. You gotta touch on the tiles in here. 
<laughs> yeah. And look at the, the seat is great. Look at that. Beautiful. Great height. Cool. We have a max air fan up there. Oh, watch the shower door. Stackable cabinet. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get the bottom. Thank you. Yeah. Very nice three nice. drawers there. Uh huh. Storage. Okay. Storage. Fantastic. Very nice. What's in here? I would guess. Stackable. Ooh, Wall shirt dryer. Beautiful. Oh my God! This is nuts. Double. This sink. is the stupidest thing I've ever seen that I absolutely love. Look how much countertop space you have back here. I know. This is fantabulous. You got his and her sink. Wow. Storage right there. You know, this is medicine cabinet. You know what? I really like the lighting in here. Just the ambiance is gorgeous. And what's in here? Oh, for linens and everything, adjustable yep. shelf. Yep. Look at the counter space. It's unbelievable. Oh my God, look at this. Oh, that's wow. nice for a trash can. Beautiful. Wow. And here we go. And look, what's under there, Matt? Storage compartment for um storage compartment for your uh engine access. No, not storage. And what's engine in here? access? The toilet. Oh. Matt, I bet you didn't even notice that the toilet wasn't in here. I did didn't you? even notice <laughs> the toilet wasn't Okay. Interesting. Prime pooping position, yes. Yes. Definitely. Okay, adjustable shelves. You know, the storage in here is great. Yes. Got a max air fan. I like that there's a window in here. Yes. That's the ladder to the bunk. And Matt, you missed these little storage compartments right here. Show everybody. Oh wow, more adjustable shelves. You know what, this is perfect for linens. Yes. And then there's your light switch. This is fantastic. It's fantastic. I, and you got a pocket door. Beautiful. I can, I can seriously say one of the best motorhomes we have ever Absolutely. Reviewed and it might be my favorite. But as nice as it is, it's now time we give you three things we love about this motorhome and three things we dislike about it. Andrea, what should we do first? Three things we dislike about it. Okay, so here's how we're going to do this segment. You ready? I'm going to give you all three dislikes. Awesome. And you give me all three likes. Absolutely. Okay. You ready? And they're all back here. Okay. One, tilt a view bag. Not a fan of it. These remotes never work right. It's not that they don't work right. Maybe I just don't know how to work them. I hate how. <laughs> no, no, no. These remotes suck. And here's what I mean. I just wish there was a button on the wall that I could push. Yeah. For when people like me lose the remote. Good point. That's one. Number two, I absolutely hate this shower. I'm, really? just, kidding. I'm just kidding. I don't like how um, the bathroom's in its own. I, I just wish it was just part of, I, I, I think this wall's silly. Does that make sense? Yeah, I get what you're saying, but like, I can appreciate it. No, why? I, I, I can't. Because this motor, like, it's a bathroom. like. Nobody's going to be, like, if somebody's taking a shower back here, they can use the half bath. You know what I'm saying? There's no need for a pocket door. It just makes it a little claustrophobic in there. Now, if it was bunkhouse model and there was a lot of people in here, that'd be a little different. So that's two things I dislike about it. And then the third, it's gonna be right here. Just like the bed. This is not a button for the awning. That is a button for the door awning. The Gerard awnings work this, from- Yeah, you were supposed oh, to say something about the Gerard yes. awnings. They work from a remote or your cell phone to go in and out, which that's cool, right? That's cool. I wish there was a button for overriding the awning as well, because it's really stupid. Okay. So what if your phone dies? What yeah, if you lose true. the remote? You know, and, 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 and quite frankly, no disrespect, but a lot of people in this price range aren't aren't up to times with the technology. They don't like they don't like apps and stuff like oh, that. So oh, we take, I, I it's okay. It. It's okay. So that's three things we don't like about it. Now wow. it's time for Andrea. Where do I begin? To give you three things she loves about this. Ba, ba, ba. Oh, I don't know where to begin, everybody. Okay, I'm gonna start with 
They did an awesome job with the colors in here, okay? The interior is fantastic. Andrea and exterior. Yes, and the exterior, oh, absolutely. I love the lighting, I love the balances, I love the backsplash. Everything about the color in here, even the, even the, the art deco and the floors and the is floors just beautiful. And the floors heated as well, which we didn't touch on that, right? Yes, we did. And so that's one. That's one. Two. What's number two? The kitchen. Fantabulous. Gorgeous. I love the farmhouse sink. I also love that there's a dishwasher in here. Absolutely. Instead of me being the dishwasher. And how big the <laughs> fridge is with the ice maker. Yes. And an actual big size convection oven. Yes. I love that. Okay. My third. Oh, wow. What's your third love? My third love is this shower. Bum, 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 bum. Get it on in there. Look at the flooring in here, Matt. The, I mean, even the flooring matches the feng shui of the motorhome. It's gorgeous. It's big, it's roomy, I can shoot my legs. It's just very aesthetically pleasing to the eyes. And I, I love it. It's This is an awesome motorhome. Absolutely. And again, let me tell everybody. At this price point, you will not get a motorhome to this level in another brand. You know, you're, you're gonna be spending 25, 30, 40, 50 thousand dollars more to get these features. Well, that's it Andrea, that's the review. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you guys have any questions about this RV, please call me, text me, send me an email. It is mattsrvreviews at gmail.com or 301-906-0962, that's myself. Or you can check us out online at mattsrvreviews.com where you can get your official Matt's RV Review sticker. Bing! Also, there's a contact me page below. Andre, do you have anything you want to say? Yes! Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. As you know, this is a brand new product. Yep. So we, we want to see what everybody thinks about it. Leave your comments and your feedback. Yep. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Uh, I loved it. Actually, I'm going to be bugging Matt probably for the rest of my life to buy me this RV. <laughs> well, we are just RV salespeople. <laughs> so, no. <laughs> well, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. Andrea, we'll see, see you next time. time.